It's Lord Rick of the Paranormal Ghost Society. We are driving through an extremely flooded section of road. There's many washed out roads that come off the mountains near Death Valley Junction. You probably couldn't see it very well, but uh, I just wanted to film this to let you know we made it out okay. And we had a wonderful adventure up in Aquaberry near the Eureka Mine and um, parts of Death Valley. We couldn't get to the coal kilns the snow just got too intense but uh we made it off we had a good adventure we got to go to bellow rat which is one of the biggest ghost towns that was in the heart of death valley or on the edge of it rather and uh this completes our tour of the area around december of 2010 and uh Nick's investigation might take place in sedona and then it's off to northern nevada where we will try to do some ghost towns and uh, areas in the foothills, also known as gold country. We didn't see no white yetis or any strange flying saucers, but we did learn a lot today. And you can understand how vast it is that anything could be up in the hills and mountains of something that's thousands of square miles of land that's been untouched sometimes for as long as a couple centuries. But anyways, check us out at www.paranormalghostsociety.org. We are more than just a paranormal group. And uh, we hope to wish everybody a happy holidays and a prosperous upcoming 2011. We had an amazing year. This finishes off a full year of at least 40 to 50 proof positive paranormal and non-paranormal locations from historical sites to cemeteries to caves to mountains to scenic areas to ghost towns we really brought a great variety something no paranormal group has really done in southern nevada in years if anything at all and we're very proud of the work and the work that we have committed in the past year including tammy's help hiking and of course we did it very shorthanded, just Tammy and I. But we pulled off a lot of cool trips and uh, Death Valley National Park was just one of them today as we encountered a lot of altitudes from being below sea level which caused a lot of pain in both my eardrums because I'm congested and sick. It just put so much pressure, my head felt like it was gonna explode but uh, after driving almost 400 miles today and around Death Valley to one edge to it almost in the other edge I'd say that this paranormal group has a lot of room in our future to continue on with our work and our exploration in many prosperous years to come so anybody listening to this we thank you for your support um, please get a t-shirt or a bumper sticker or get some paranormal equipment and help support our cause because we're the ones that go out and we do it we do it up all the time and we do some of the most amazing sites and things and we're lucky enough to talk about them and share them with the public uh, this is your founder of the paranormal ghost society lord rick and your host of angel of thy night radio